Hi there, guys. We're back with another reaction because Star Wars Celebration is going on and we are getting teasers that are dropping. Uh, we have a teaser for Star Wars Jedi Survivor, the sequel to Fallen Order. Uh, for those of you that have been around me know that I enjoyed Fallen Order quite a bit. Um, it was like one of the first uh, look as much as I love the Battlefront games, but I, I and I do love them quite a bit. Uh Fallen Order was like the first game in quite a while where it was like, oh, thank God, this is what I've been wanting. You know, that type of that type of story. Um, and the future is bright for Star Wars games uh, because we have a ton of things in development. Um, but hi, guys, I'm Josh Nano 2 and I'm going to be doing a reaction video for this teaser here in just a minute. It is a minute and 23 seconds long, so it's not a lot. It's just a teaser. Uh, we are gonna we're, we're gonna watch it, uh, but first I gotta do like the the homework business, which is hey guys come by on Monday on my Twitch channel for the Clockwork Cantina podcast that I do with DT3. Uh, if you don't know who DT3 is, come find out who he is. He's awesome. He, he the dude knows everything Star Wars. I know a bit of Star Wars. I'm not gr I, I can't remember things like he can though. The dude can remember everything. But come by the podcast. We talk. All sorts of news, gaming news, TV news, movie news. We talked about games all the time. We talk about Star Wars a lot of the time. Um, so make sure to come by the Clockwork Cantina on Mondays at 3 p.m. Eastern Time, 12 p.m. Pacific Time. And um, yeah, uh, he's currently, DT is currently at Star Wars Celebration. And on the next podcast on Monday, which is as of today on the 30th. Uh, so we got a few days. And uh, he's, we're going to be talking about Star Wars Celebration, the things he's seen. We'll probably go over some of the photos he's taken because he's taken quite a bit and he shared them with me. Uh, but right now, let's get into this teaser trailer reaction. We'll give some thoughts on it. I don't do a lot of reaction videos, but you will see me react to this. So let us check it out, shall we? Let's get the camera up here. We are capturing the video. Let us check it out. It's a little loud. Responded a great job on this, on the first Tell game. Cal Kestis, why lead when they won't follow? What is your next move, Jedi? So next year, that is awesome. We don't have to wait very long. We are already like almost halfway through this year, guys. So we don't have to wait too much longer for Jedi Survivor. I have no idea what's going on in this trailer. You know, as we can see, Cal Kestis is back. I like that. I like the character, obviously. Um, we had an Utapon in there. Is it? Is he? It is not the Inquisitor, right? Like it. 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 it, it no, it is definitely not. But it is a, a Utapau. Um uh person there. Who is in the back to tank? Is that um I uh, is that I have no idea who's in the back to tank. Uh maybe my mind is misremembering. Maybe it's a character we haven't met yet and are going to meet, but it's good to see that Cal Kestis's journey is gonna continue. Um I am super interested. Oh, wow. Okay, sorry. I was just looking at the synopsis. Um, so the synopsis on the YouTube video says, picking up five years after the events of Star, uh, events of Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order, uh, it is a third-person narrative stuff. But it, it's going to pick up five years after the original game. Wow, that's quite a little jump there in the time, time, uh, timescape, huh? So where does, that, where does that put us exactly? Oh, crap. I can't remember exactly where Fallen Order ends. Let me see if the, the Googles can let me figure it out really quick. 
where exactly that fits in. Because I am just... I, if you guys watched yesterday's Andor video, which, by the way, please go check out our Andor teaser um, reaction, you will know that my brain, as I've gotten older, has just become like a bit of an airhead. Like, I just, I just forget things. Um, so I don't remember exactly where Fallen Order ends. Uh, because I'm, I'm bad. Pretty bad with that stuff. At remembering. Just might look up the timeline here. So Fallen Order takes place five years after Revenge of the Sith. Um, so this will be ten years after Revenge of the Sith. Anyways, guys, make sure to come by the Clockwork Cantina on Monday. We will be talking about all over, all over this stuff, I'm sure. Uh, DT, if, if he doesn't make a comment in the post below about the timeline, because I'm bad with timelines, I'm sure we'll talk about it on the podcast. Um, yeah, I didn't realize that was five years later. That's really interesting that they're putting it there. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this reaction video. Make sure to go check out the other reaction videos that we have on the channel. Um, we have a few. I don't do them a whole lot. I kind of want to do them more. I'm getting into video editing. So we are going to video edit this video and put it up on YouTube. So uh, thank you guys for checking it out. Uh, like, subscribe, all that stuff below. Comment, all that stuff. Let me know what you think. Let me know what I can improve on. What do you guys want me to do better? Um, that will help me do a lot better. Uh, and anyway, that's going to do it for this reaction, guys. We'll see you on the next one. Take it easy.